you're looking for a screen drum. Hello guys, today we are presenting our Ascotec SDA mini screening machine. For the start, I need to mention this perfect hopper, 1600 millimeter in width, which yeah, uh, is likely to use than any other uh, smaller hopper that we previously had on the machine. What's What's really important is that we also have this vibration support here. So a little vibration engine that uh, clears the space, the inner space of uh, our hopper on the uh, SD Mini. One more thing, we do have a powerful engine that operates for the whole uh, machine. What we can offer are three variations of drum. You can choose between full drum, so you can change the meshes in that case but if you want to change the meshes the screening holes you can use our segment drum we can offer you screen meshes or perforated screen plates in this case we have a screen mesh that is five times five millimeter also what i need to mention besides this screen drum is definitely our cleaning brush that is used to clean the drum so to clean the material off the drum and lastly but not least important is our uh, electrical cabinet its main switch we have start button we have stop button uh, direction buttons uh, left and right we have the uh, vibration motor uh, pot potentiometer, we have a speed potentiometer and we have our counter. We connected the power supply to our 400 volt socket. I'm going to turn on the machine right now. So main switch goes to on, we just need to press the start button and if we want to go right, we press right. And simply as you can see, the drum starts moving. It's pretty slow, I can see, but we can regulate the speed of the drum easily with this potentiometer right here. So, as you can see, if I turn the speed on four, or maybe five, six, seven, etc., it starts to rotate faster and faster. If I want to switch the direction of screening, I'm pressing the stop, and then I'm pressing the left button. Additional option while screening is turning on the vibration motor. What's also important on the SD Mini screening machine are these support feet. So why? Because with these support feet, the screening angle of the machine can be easily set only like this as you can see the wheel of the machine is now lifted from the ground whereas the support feet is completely touching the ground right now all four support feet are applied and the wheels are totally free with these support feet you will have more lifetime of all those wheels that you use on SD Mini. What about if we want to move a machine a little bit further? We do have these transport beams. We only need to use the forklift, of course, to lift the machine up, put it on a trailer and drive it any way we want. And now, after all the description and the details, let's start with the screening. So guys, as you can see, the screening process is over. You can see the results. We do have some pretty big pieces, but we also have a, some small pieces as well. I need to remind you that in this case, we used five times five millimeter screening mesh. And the results you're looking for are right here. If you're looking for a screening machine, 
that's not too heavy as the Mini is for you. It only weighs 600 kilos. It's possible to screen up to 20 cubic meters per hour. Everything you see here can be exchanged or not used, such as these support feet, this hopper right here, and the most important, the drum itself. As I have previously said, you can use it as a segment all of, or a full drum. The mesh width, we can offer everything from four times four to 100 times 100 millimeters. So guys, uh, we are definitely finished with screening process and now we need to go to visit some more places. We place our SD Mini on a trailer. We only need to fasten it with fasteners additionally, of course, and off we go.